Dante AV Lip Sync Considerations On Dante AV encoders receiving media from HDMI or SDI inputs, the audio and video are in lip sync. For Dante AV cameras with local mic line inputs, these channels will follow Dante audio latency adjustments. Overall, the time a device takes to process video is greater than dealing with uncompressed audio, so Dante Controller offers options for compensation of audio on transmitters. All Dante devices will default to 1 millisecond transport latency in order to sync all playouts across the network. However, video devices have different processing times. A camera normally takes a little bit more time than an encoder that already works with the digitalized video. This time is added on the Dante AV transmitting device to delay its audio source. In this case, as the Dante AV Ultra is working in ultra-low latency mode, it knows that the glass-to-glass -glass latency will be 8 milliseconds in total, so it adds 7 milliseconds to the audio. For Dante AV Ultra cameras that must consider more steps of the process of the digitalization of video, this fader will show different values. The devices will send different packets for video, audio and clocking. With timestamps on each packet, the internal clock of each device can time-align audio and video delivery to the playout. Dante AV devices follow IEEE 1588 PTP Precision Time Protocol for clocking, following a single clock leader for all types of media. The system will elect a clock leader sharing PTP packets via multicast a few times per second, keeping all network devices in sync. With their internal clocks synchronized, devices can compensate for delay adjustments you may have made to achieve a tighter lip sync. We recommend reviewing the Dante certification program on the chapter about clocking in the Layer 2 environment for more details about PTP, Precision Time Protocol, and the clock leader election. A single clock leader provides clocking information for all devices on the network, regardless of what media type they are transporting, audio or video, and whatever sample rates or frame rates they may be working with. This allows your system to have Dante AV hardware and software running at different frame rates, different resolutions, different aspect ratios, however, all of them clock into the same source. As it would happen between Dante audio devices running at different sample rates, for two or more Dante AV endpoints that want to communicate, they must be running with the same codec. In terms of frame rates and resolution, the Dante AV receiver will match the image coming from the Dante AV transmitter. It will detect the signal and automatically adjust its local output. Summarizing this chapter, Dante AV devices follow IEEE 1588 PTP Precision Time Protocol for clocking, following a single clock leader for all types of media. Audio, video and clocking packets are sent separately. Receivers will buffer audio and video data, time align them and play out to host device. It is possible to delay the audio from a transmitter to match the video latency according to each codec processing time.